The Import Export Copy Components tool is an essential tool that will be used by any faculty member who uses the MyCourses system because this is the tool that you use to copy an entire course or individual components from one course to another. This tutorial is going to show you how to copy an entire course from one course to another. So the first thing that's very important is make absolutely certain that you're in an empty course shell before proceeding with the following. So once you've entered the course shell, so I'm going to go ahead into my course shell. I'm going to click on the course content tab on the nav bar. And I'm going to click on table of contents. And I'm going to see, oh my good, oh my gosh, I have content. So if you see content already in your course, do not import content into this course. If you do, it will append the existing content and cause real confusion. It doesn't overwrite and get rid of what's there. So it'll just have duplicates and triplicates. It could mean you've already copied content into your course, or you're using a master course where the content was already imported for you. If you're not sure what to do, please send an email to my courses for faculty, four is the number four, at spcollege.edu and to get an answer. In other words, do not copy if you see content in your course. It could mean that I made a mistake. I went into the wrong course. So I'm going to go back home. And I'm going to go into this course. I'm going to click on Course Content tab. I'm going to click on Table of Contents. And oh, I don't see any content. So this is the, my blank course. I'm ready to go now. I click on Import, Export, Copy. Ex I mean, ex Import, Export button. Click on Search for an Offering. In the Select for an Offering screen will appear. In the search for text box, type in some keywords for the course you want to copy from. This can include the name, section number of the course, if you want. So I'm going to type in that. I'm going to hit the Enter key, or I can click on the search icon. I'm going to find the course that I need. I'm going to click on the radio button next to the course. I'm going to click Add Selected. I'm going to click Copy All Components. Now, on the next screen, you'll see the progress of the copy course. It's important to not hit the back button or navigate away from this page. Again, do not repeat these steps or you will have duplicates of your course material. Once the course is, is complete, you'll see a green checkbox. You can then view your course content via the course content tab. And now you'll see I have content in the course. And again, do not repeat the copy steps or you will have duplicates of your course material in your new course shell.